Health information technology and health information management is a profession that is a non-clinical, but it's a healthcare um, industry. And it's wonderful because you're able to use your sciences, you're able to um, gain a lot of clinical knowledge, work with clinical and other healthcare professionals. Do everything from request records from other organizations to doing deficiency analysis where we go through the patient's record to make sure everything is completed by the providers, that we meet all the standards for our accreditation. I was working full time as a business and financial analyst and raising two kids and keeping a house and I wanted to be able to get my degree in something that I cared about which is healthcare and information and I was able to do both at the same time. We get to work with the healthcare professionals to make sure that the documentation is done accurately and completely and then we're involved with um, all the confidentiality and maintaining that electronic health record. I love being able to look at something that most people only see as chaos and finding patterns to help make well-informed decisions or to give the decision makers the information they need to be able to make good decisions. You learn something every day and it is never boring. We also are involved in the insurance industry. You might see us in um, Blue Cross or Medicare. Um, we might be in an auditing profession where we're looking at the documentation and validating the um, information there. You might work for an attorney and review records. And I really think that the health information and informatics management is more of a holistic program in how to make all this data, and we're, we're gonna keep on getting a lot more of it, and make it useful. When it's just out there and not transformed, it's noise. The online programs at Davenport have allowed our students to be much more flexible in the way that they're able to complete their program. Um, it is allowing students to be able to schedule their education with their family life and their work life that they're already experiencing. I didn't get my master's until I was 53 and it increased my income significantly. I'm making twice as much as I was before the program and am respected, listened to, and when I say something, people know that I've got the data behind me. And if you want to make an impact and make a decent living, this is a good way to go.